Thank you. Because <laughs> we need to get into coffee talk yeah. because we have something to debate right now. Now that we've gotten through the first St. Louis City SC match out of the way, we need to work on shortening that name because that was a mouthful just now. I told you I've been learning more about soccer and something that I have recently found out is that most soccer teams have a nickname for reasons like that, <laughs> to shorten the name. For example, Orlando City is nicknamed the Lions. Colorado Rapids are the Pids, short for Rapids. Sporting Kansas City is the Wizards. So I'm on a St. Louis City SC fans Facebook page and right now tensions are rising mm. trying to decide what our nickname is gonna be. A lot of people are saying the dogs because of the Purina sponsor. The stadium actually has a dog section for your pets. They're very dog friendly. And Purina is already working to find a Labrador Retriever puppy to become the team's official facility dog, kind of like the Blues have. But many say the Purina sponsor is going to change someday and then it won't make sense for us to be the dogs. They're also saying Purina feeds all kinds of pets, leading us to the Hellcats. Now this the option, Hellcats. yeah. Hellcats. So Not this, the Hellbenders, the Hellcats. No, someone did suggest the Hellbenders, but most people are on this Hellcats thing. They say there's history behind it. So try and follow me here. The president of the club, Carolyn Kendall, is the granddaughter of Jaxie Taylor. Jaxie Taylor is the Enterprise Rent-A-Car founder and a decorated Navy pilot. Taylor flew the famous Hellcat mm, F6F uh, fighter plane wow. during World War II. I like that. I like it too. That's why there is already a Hellcat bar at the stadium. Now, some are saying Hellcat sounds too much like an XFL team. <laughs> Who gets to decide it, that, it, though? It does a little All bit. Right, I don't know. Right. Others say, let the nickname just be City. Why can't we just be City? Some are saying anyone could be city, and some are saying don't force it. Let it come naturally with time. Hmm. All I'm saying, all I ask is that we really put some thought into this because I found out in doing some research that the New York City team, their nickname is the Pigeons. And I really don't want us go, to end something up. Like that mm -hmm. could, yeah. Yeah. Something like that could happen. You don't want that. We got to rein this in. I think you're we right. Do. Yeah, because yeah, we do not want to be the, the pigeons. <laughs> the stool pigeons. Now you mentioned the Battle Hawks. And I find this interesting, that there's been very little chatter, I saw it on social media, about the fight that broke out in that game I, against uh, yes, DC. Right at I the tail end of the game. Did you right? see it? I, I haven't seen it, but I've heard I about it. I saw a it. video, and then someone said, looks like we found our rivals, which I think oh, DC well, would be an interesting Well, DC's coming here, I think, later. Is it game five? I think is is against DC, and I assume it's going to be here since we played there yep. once already. So, <laughs> good luck, DC. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, all of these names, we got Battle Hawks, we yeah. got the Hellcats, right. we got the Dogs, City, Pigeon. we want to know what you think. Go on Facebook, answer the question, what do you think the nickname for St. Louis City SC should be? Head on over to our Facebook page and share your answers like with us. The rally The what? Came. Someone said the socks. The, the pinkish shirts. Hmm, the pinkish we already have people answering. Socks. Pink or red? Yeah, we could be the magenta. The peds. Magnets. <laughs> Rinks. Don't let me decide. <laughs> the Rinks. We gotta work on it. We'll have okay. it all figured out by 10:15. Yeah.